Hi everybody, welcome to Mike's Classic Pinball. I, in case you had forgotten, am Mike. Where the hell have you been? I hear you cry. I know, it's been a long few months since I last was uh, hanging out with you. And it's good to see everybody again, but I wanted to put this together quick and kind of tell you where things are at, what things have been going on, what has what I have been up to or lack of that lack thereof in the last little bit and kind of um, bring you up to date on stuff so um, it's been like I said a very long weird few months I uh, kind of started back in the middle of November now some of you from my very earliest videos may remember Proby here he is now Proby in case some of you hadn't guessed or didn't see that part is actually my dear brother Dave and uh, back in mid-November he became very very ill uh, my daughter actually took him to the hospital I joined him there shortly thereafter and uh, he was afraid he had COVID because uh, he couldn't breathe turns out he did not have COVID thank goodness but uh, he kind of wishes he had because he had everything else uh, and I mean that probably pretty close to uh, literally states you have everything you mean I have pneumonia yes juvenile diabetes yes hysterical pregnancy a, a little bit yeah he ended up having uh, bronchitis emphysema pneumonia lung bacteria and a handful of other things and uh, from the time we got him to the hospital till a few hours later, uh, he ended up being uh, in intensive care and intubated. He couldn't, he, uh, he stopped breathing. And uh, there, that was probably the scariest few minutes of my life, deciding whether or not to do that, because as some of you know, uh, when you are intubated at that point, you are only one in three chance of ever coming out of it. But, um, yeah, so it was a pretty scary situation. He also ended up uh, after, he, he, well, he was in the hospital a really long time, uh, close to a month. And uh, after that, he ended up almost a month in uh, a rest home as well. And, you know, by the time we got him home, the holidays was over and, uh, you know, everything was uh, kind of at a rough spot. Now, in the middle of all of that, while I was helping take care of him, I found myself uh, very abruptly unemployed. Uh, the company that I worked for uh, sold to another owner and I lost my job. Now, I was planning on going back to work shortly thereafter. I, I had dedicated all of my time uh, to job hunting. And uh, I was successful in a lot of ways, uh, got a lot of interesting offers, and I was kind of waiting for the offer to come along that I really, really wanted. But uh, things kept falling apart, and then I was finally getting ready to go back to work, and I ended up with COVID. Yep, sure enough, I got the, uh, the vidco. And, um, you know, oh, don't talk about COVID on a YouTube video, I'll get, you'll get demonetized. Yeah, I'm making money from this, sure. Um, but no, I and it wiped me out, which is weird, because I'm triple vaccinated, and I wear masks in public, I sanitize all the time, I do all of that, I still ended up with it. And then it ran through my house. My son ended up getting it. My son James ended up getting COVID as well. And, uh, you know, we thought initially that my wife and daughter had gotten it, but it uh, turns out it was just the flu for them lucky lucky people but so that wiped me out for a couple of week couple two three weeks I was just obliterated but uh, got back on my feet and uh, got healthy again uh, my sense of taste and smell is only just now starting to come back so it's been weird um, and I gotta admit I probably put on a couple of pounds because eating became a joy again but Beside the point, 
Um, in between all of this, I did end up going back to work um, just a few weeks ago, actually. I got a really good job that uh, I absolutely love, and it's actually quite an interesting job I'll have to tell you about some other time. But uh, back to pinball. So what's going on? Where are we at with stuff? Well, uh, the other reason I would, wasn't really able to do as much as I wanted with pinball, and this sounds like kind of a bullshit explanation, but it's true. Uh, my garage where I work on my games is really, really, really cold. And it's been unbelievably cold here in Utah for a while now. Um, yeah, but during the day, you know, my, my poor garage slash studio, um, it's only about 15, 20 degrees. And I'm sorry, I can't sit and work on a pinball in that. It's just too damn cold. So, um, things are warming up now a little bit. I'm healthier. I'm back to work. Life has started to return to some kind of normalcy. So, we've still got the three projects sitting uh, sitting in the studio. We've got the, uh, uh, the Shuffle Alley, which is all but done. Just a couple of cosmetics and one little bug I have left to work out. So, Josh, your game is almost done. Uh, Piccadilly is pretty much finished. I just need to put, you know, put a little bit of polish back on it and then reassemble. And that's ready to go. Uh, still figuring out where that's going to go. That may go to Rob Burke's collection. But uh, then on top of that, we also have, um, we have Larry's um, uh, Bally Champ. And I got the plate for that. It's... Uh, it's installed and everything is good on that just a couple of bugs to work out there and then I can finish the cosmetics so I'm almost done with these projects and we're almost to the point where I can call them finished um, I do have new projects coming uh, a couple of very interesting ones in the pipeline right now uh, one of them I, you know a couple of them I'm gonna do uh, I'm gonna do some gun games again some rifle games uh, looking at a couple of them that uh, may get a chance to do and then I just recently got a call about a nice old beautiful game that I'm gonna keep a bit of a secret for now hey I said it was a secret um, but uh, yeah I got a call about the possible restoration for that so that's gonna be exciting and fun I'm looking forward to that and then I've been giving a lot of thought to how I do these episodes and how I do these videos. I'm, a, I'm thinking I'm going to change things up a little bit. Now, when I do restart in the next couple of weeks, I will tell you this, they're not going to be as frequent as they were. Um, I was turning out almost way too many videos, like I was a professional YouTuber or something. And it's almost like I was sacrificing the quality of the videos that I was doing just for volume of content. And I need to do better at that. I need to not do quite so many just stupid, quick, little banger bullshit videos. Um, so I'm working on maybe some new ideas on how to do it. And what I want to do is bring you guys better videos that are more helpful and not this stuff that was scraped from the inside of a dog's ass instead. Um, so some changes coming there that I'm really looking forward to trying out. Uh, I'm going to try probably my next couple of videos in a different format that I've seen a couple of other YouTubers doing. I'm excited to try. And then I've got some other video ideas of some cool stuff I want to do. But So we have projects coming again. My garage is warming up. My body is getting back to a point where I can breathe and do things again. So... Um, stuff is coming. Be patient with me. I appreciate everybody, all of the uh, well wishes that I was sent while I was down. Uh, all of my friends who got a hold of me and said, hey, hope you're all right. I really appreciate you guys. Uh, it means an awful lot to me. So thank you for that. Um, it, it really does mean a lot. So uh, lots of cool, exciting stuff coming. I'm looking forward to sharing it with you. Uh, I'm going to try and get back actually into my studio um, today, actually. If not today, then next week. But uh, I'm going to try and get back into everything and see what we can do to make some really good content for you. Make some videos that, uh, that you'll enjoy and uh, share pinball with people. 
So uh, thank you again to everybody, uh, and thank you to my new subscribers. I hope to bring you some cool stuff very, very soon. Uh, lots of changes coming, and uh, I look forward to hanging out with you all again very, very soon and to bringing you some new games. Until then, uh, you know, keep your balls polished and uh, keep your rod clean. And I will see you all later. Have a great day.